Okay, so this is this is a first time listen, yes, with this performance. That's how that falls under here. So uh, this is the warning. I, I'm already gonna say something. I'm okay. Here it is. What a wonderful performance! They're amazing. They're talented. Their energy is incredible. No matter if they're in the studio of their basement studio or the cave or what do they call it? The cave, the warning cave. Or if they're playing in front of thousands of people, or if they're playing in front of five people, the warning's the same. They come out, they deliver, they rock, they're awesome. They're beautiful. They're talented. They're humble. They're everything that a rock star should be. And on stage, their characters, their rock personas come out, pow, with their hair flying around, dropping sticks and throwing them at people. Uh, you've got uh, uh, Allie, you know, crouching and bending down with the bass and you know she's going to hit somebody with that one day and then you got Danny screaming the rock and roll energy from the from her lungs and the snarl and the sneer and the the shredding guitar work they're awesome they're amazing uh but before we get to the video I just want to check I'm just going to check one thing okay just we're going to pause it okay here we go all right, I'm back. I just wanted to double check on my channel. I know I've done I've done the doll nice performance uh, from the uh, from these sisters. I just wanted to make sure which ones they were. So I did the warning reaction. Yeah, live at Lenario, uh, Lenario CDMX. That's one of my first ones. I did that a year ago, and then I did uh, the same one, same song. The acoustic. That's what it was. This what I wanted to make sure because I knew I did a Patreon one before. I just wanted to make sure that it wasn't. That would have been embarrassing. You guys would have been like, well, that's okay, Ryan, because it, it, it does matter. I don't want to totally repeat myself. I did uh, the acoustic version, Patreon version, which was amazing. So here we go. Let's just listen to the. And again, I encourage, I, I'd, be, I'd be interested in the comments below from anyone that's never heard of the warning before coming to my channel, maybe. It's, there's a few of you, not many, I know, but because I'm nobody. But uh, there are a few listeners on my channel who've just, who have discovered the warning with me in my journey. But I'm kind of curious if anyone's listening to this one for the first time. Like, this is their first time seeing them play. Uh, so here we go. Let's check it out. I'm sure they won't disappoint. They could pack into three minutes what some bands can't do in three albums. Here we go. Me? There she is. There's, I love that Danny singing. Sings deeper, slipping 
Nice. Okay, these girls are awesome. Yes, I said girls. Leave me alone. I'm, they're so much younger than me. They're but they're I, they're they're literally literally the same age. Well, they're younger than my two older sons. Put it that way. So, um, anyways, so I feel protective of them. Not that they need me. They got thousands of fans. This is the dad in me, right? But they're so talented, so amazing. Uh, it really is a joy to watch them. It really is a joy to watch them. I really hope to see them in concert one day. Um, they, they, they have that rock and roll gift. They truly do. Uh, Allie looks like she's grown like five feet. Her legs are taller than Pal's drum kit. It's crazy. Uh, yeah, and I'm really excited for their... Let me just commentate for a little bit. Why not? It's only a three-minute song. Uh, some people were actually hesitant or worried about them having the record contract. And I say to them, don't worry. They're fine. You know, losing that independence looks... Uh, the little I know about the, any kind of industry, but you know, the, the point of signing with the company is you get a little bit of a little bit of financial help. And I know they're going to keep their Patreon page, and that's great that they're able to do that. But the point is, is that, you know, they don't... They wouldn't need the Patreon page the way they've been using it, is my understanding. When you're, when you're signed with a record label, you, you have financial push. You have help saying, oh, you need some instruments, you need some recording equipment, you need a studio to record your album, you need a producer, they pay for that. The band's not paying for that. And then the idea is, is that, of course, the record sales and touring will bring money to both the company and to the young ladies. And there's nothing wrong with making money when you're good at something. There's nothing worse when people make money when they're crappy at something. I don't want to name any artists, okay, but there's artists who are huge right now. Huge. And I'm not going to name any songs, but there's a song that is three letters. That's all it is. It's three letters. It's an acronym for something. And it's gotten tens of hundreds of millions of views and making these artists and the companies insane amount of money. And it's just garbage. It really is just garbage compared to what these young ladies are doing. Look at this. They're, uh, they're dressed appropriately, but they're still rock stars. And these other videos, it's just, um, I don't know. The this way, when you have children or you have, young, or you have young adults in your life, or if you're just an adult, what would you rather be caught watching? You know what I mean? So that's just me. That's old man Ryan talking. I know, but I'm just saying it's hard. It's hard for me to be a fan of a band that has the talent to be bigger than what they are. And there's not a lot of bands that I listen to in general that aren't big that shouldn't be bigger than what they are. That's me. That's my opinion. I'm sticking to it. 